This husk should be easier to climb than the muddy terrain. I ain't comfortable calling it a husk, seeing as we're about to climb it and all. Clearly not a husk. It is the hollowed husk of a bygone time, when the turmoil of war raged stronger than the storms of this world. Peter, get moving. Drax is having an existential meltdown. All fails, shoot stuff. Words to live by. Didn't think I'd ever be shooting at a resistance ship. The mud in this area smells queer. It's them deli things we buy. I think they, uh, you know... Loose reactor isn't dangerous, is it? It can be, if you know what you're doing. What's a resistance ship doing all the way out here anyway? It's doing nothing. It's clearly crashed. I mean, what was it doing? You don't think the war made it all the way out here? The war was everywhere. Drax, you could pull this reactor out gently, right? If it were combustible, the rodents would have shot it by now. He makes an excellent point. Shall I continue ripping it apart? No, no, no. I think we're good. We made it halfway up. Now what? Maybe if we could lower that wing somehow. Uh, uh. There they are. Wing controls. Anyone else hear something? Hear what? Need your expert skills again, Rocket. All right, Rocket. That wing control panel is all yours. It still works. Great. Everyone watch out for beeping red lights. What? Why? This is a resistance ship. We'll be lucky if there's only one booby trap on it. Clark, that don't sound like no jelly thing. They say that Lady Hellbender's call echoes throughout the planet. That don't sound like no lady either. Careful! Looks like something big moved through here. Yay! I am eager to experience Lady Hellbender's legendary menagerie. <laughs> yeah, I bet you are. If you see anything with claws the size of Drax, let me know. I thought we already had our monster. What's she tracking the- Let me guess. Some kind of- monster thing. Good guess. Well done. Any chance it doesn't know we're here? Nope. Only question is, which one of us it'll jump first? It's probably not gonna jump us. Mm-hmm. Where did you learn this clairvoyance, assassin? Huh? You never learned to track? Tathians do not chase our prey. We lure them and await the perfect moment to strike. You sure you want to get lost out here? Relax. I'm just looking around. This place is a flarkin' maze. All those trees look like... Like giant strings of saltwater taffy. What? What's taffy? It's sweet and delicious and it melts in your mouth. And looks like a tree, apparently. And it is made of salted water. No, that's just the name. So, uh, these tracks, Gamora, you're just messing with us, right? Nope. <laughs> Are you frightened, rodent? I'm cautious. You try being this size. I gotta watch out for things that can eat me in one gulp.
weapons are deep. This thing has got to weigh more than all of us put together. Trying to stay ready. We had wanted. We never go anywhere. Good point. We have a plant guy to take care of a plant problem. He says plants aren't problems. I don't know. Rocket, can you take care of those branches? You want me to blow it up? That shouldn't be our answer to everything. Drax, think this is a sign from Lady Hellbender? We are clearly not wanted on this planet. Get us through here, Gamora. Whatever it takes to find Hellbender. Hey, this lady. Yeah, Gamora. And if we want an audience with her, we will have to start showing some respect. This from the guy who calls me Harlot Spawn of Thanos. An accurate description. We all know which Harlot Spawn in the first. <laughs> what about her sister Nebula? Gamora's actually adopted, so not even that accurate. Uh, yeah. Also, not a Harlot. Right, right. Th that too. We'll need to find a way out of this jungle. Why? It's dry down here. Wouldn't you rather be wet than lost? Should we ask them for directions? I'm thinking maybe they are directions. Seriously? Oh, like a signpost or something. I'm not saying it's an arrow with the word fortress on it, but statues suggest civilization, and the only settlement I saw when we were topside was Lady Hellbender's fortress. Tech over there? Ask the Chitauri. No, no, it is. It's a retractable bridge. They used them at the prison I was in. Too bad the controls are on the other side of the giant chasm. We what do you do not have time to dawdle in this jungle? I shall hurl the creature over the chasm so he may activate the bridge. I may activate a hole through your face! Put me down! No! We're not throwing rockets. Very well. You sons of fucking dogs! How will we cross? Scum, don't face Look the Look around, we'll find another way.
Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Just leave it. What's your problem? My problem is Meathead trying to huck me over a cliff. There has to be something we can use. Maybe a tall tree? <laughs> Taller than Groot. No, it would not. What if he breaks a leg? He would still have three. No one's throwing rocks. No, the statues are not watching us. Do not be so sure. You say Lady Hellbender has eyes everywhere. Of course they do. Lady Hellbender repelled an invading swarm, and it was among the spoils. Maybe. Or maybe she was real cozy with the bus. Ridiculous. Only thing, Shatari. Some of these statues look familiar if you catch my drift. If these mouth breathers worship monsters. Maybe they'd have seen spacefaring bugs as gods. You belittle the Sechnarfians, knowing nothing of their ways. I know folks that carve idols worship them, and I know anyone with half a brain don't worship nothing. 